guys, welcome back to more Silent Hill 3, so let's continue. Right, so we have to find something to recover that key because Heather is too much of a too much of a lazy girl to actually try to move those things away so she can get the key. It could have it could be such a simple thing to do. But hey, it wouldn't be Silent Hill if this was that simple, right? Alright, so I guess we can go through here. There's gonna be two closers in this area, so be careful. No, this is not where we gotta go. Actually, it would have been faster if I went the other way, but... Ellen's Bakery. Alright, so what we need is this. And I guess we can read this. There's a flyer. Crispy toasted bread right to your very door. Everything on sale, Helen's Bakery. Okay, there's really nothing more important in this room, so you can leave and make your way back to the other room to get the key. Well, I, I, I wonder if... Yes, I can. Alright, good. Guess I still remember how to dodge Silent Hill monsters. Some of them anyway. No. Be good. Now I think you can go also in this room, but there's nothing in there but a dog and some beef jerky. Which I don't ever use in this game, ever. So, there's no point actually. At least for me. Anyway. Uh, items? I'm gonna use that. I got the key, taking with tongs. Okay. Actually, we gotta go back. Hello! 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 Oh dear. Do not, don't even, don't even think about it. Don't even think about it. Alright, so now we can actually go this way. And go to the bookshop. We're gonna have a little puzzle. Let's see how I do. It shouldn't be difficult. It shouldn't be. But we'll see. Actually, first I think that we have some items over here. Yes, we have some handgun bullets. I'm gonna need that. Right. Pick this books up. Alright. So now we have to use the books over here, I think. Um, Shakespeare Anthology. Alright. Where on a shelf will you place the book? Okay, so... Let's see, number one... Uh, come on. It was already selected. Uh, no, that doesn't seem like it should be the first one. That's not the first one either. Nope. See the third one. Maybe this one, yeah. Um No this one? Sounds about right. No. I'm gonna go with the last one. Nope. Okay, so it should be this one maybe. There we go. This doesn't look right. Or does it? 4031? 4031. We can actually try that one. 4031. 4031. I think... 03... No, that, that can't be. They can't be, they can't be. 
it doesn't look right. It doesn't look right at all. Alright, let's try this again. Um, these ones look right. Okay, so maybe it's... Ah, hold on. Number four. This one maybe should be the first. Number five should be here. Number two, over here. Um, it's this one. Yes, now it looks right. Okay, zero three one four. Zero three one four. Come on, Heather. Zero three one four. Zero. Three, one, four. There we go. I knew that it it didn't look right at first. It was just too weird. But we didn't lose anything for trying it, right? Um, hey, wait. What's going on? Where is everybody? Those weird monsters? They have come to witness the beginning. The rebirth of paradise, despoiled by mankind. What are you talking about? Don't you know? Your power is needed. How should I know? I am Claudia. So what? Remember me, and your true self as well. Also, that which you must become. The one who will lead us to paradise with blood-stained hands. Claudia, right? Did you do all this? It was the hand of God. <laughs> So we just met Claudia Wolf. Um, remember that name. <laughs> anyway, um, I just love how quote unquote bitchy Heather can be. It's, ah, oh, I love it. I don't know why. A lot of people don't like it, but I'm one of those people that do. I love it. Absolutely love it. Heather is actually one of my favorite characters in any Silent Hill game. Um, anyway. I don't think you can go in any of these doors, but I'm just checking it just in case. I think that the only way you can go is through that elevator. So that's exactly what we're gonna do. doesn't have any buttons. There are no buttons for the elevator. Yep. Oh, look! Our friendly radio always tells us when there's any kind of danger nearby. A radio. What the hell is this doing falling down from the ceiling? Anyway, I guess that explains the static from just before. But all it's picking up is static. I wonder if it's broken. I got a radio. Radio? What's going on with that radio? I think this is one of the best cutscenes in the game right here. Thank <laughs> you. 
Batman. Not even a kid could believe in this. <laughs> I think that just there was Valtiel. I think. Alright, so, out of the elevator, it's gonna be a bunch of dogs in here! Jesus! Scare! Ah! Let's give the crap out of me! No, please don't! Oh shit, none of these fucking doors open. No, no! Oh my god! Oh, no, 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 no. Go over there. I'm having a hard time controlling Heather thanks to this new controller. Sometimes it makes me uh, run in circles like this. Alright. I think I will get used to it eventually. Oh, hello! Have some uh, items over here, which is nice. Um, what more? And we have a safe point. I wonder if she says anything else. Um, but I'm not gonna check it out just yet. I think that next time we see another safe point, she will uh, actually say what she has to say. So it shouldn't really matter. Now, I believe there's gonna be a bathroom here somewhere where we need to get an item from. Hello. And we also need to find the flashlight. So that's essential, basically. Oh god, there's gonna be closers in here. This is not where we need to go yet. Is it? No, it's not. Okay. I know exactly what we need to do in that room, but we don't have the item that we need for that. So, hello. I actually need to go over here, and I think the bathroom's over here somewhere. I think. Yes, it is. Which there's actually, I think in, is, it is in this bathroom that's actually... Oh, this is not the bathroom. This is where we find the flashlight. All right. Um, what does it say? Warning: When leaving the room, be sure to turn out the lights. It will be obvious if they are not switched off. Um, actually, I don't need to do that because the flashlight's right here. There we go. Have some items, but you know what? I'll turn off the light. There we go. Um, now moving on. Bathroom? Yes. Actually, there's a funny Easter egg over here in this bathroom. Uh, I think it's kind of an uh, homage to James. Um, I'll just let you guys watch it and, uh, you know. Oh, she won't do anything? Oh, so I'm guessing that it's not in this bathroom? Wait. It's in one of the bathrooms that you you can actually find that Easter egg. All right. Well, it's soaking with blood, but there's no one here. Did someone respond, or is it just me? All right. Now. Yep. She still doesn't do it. Okay. So I'm guessing it's in another bathroom, or maybe you'll have to play the game a certain amount of times. I don't know. Or maybe... No, it, it wouldn't make any sense, so never mind. Um, but yeah, you can actually find that Easter egg in one of the bathrooms. Um, apparently I couldn't find it now, so... Anyway. 
Ooh, almost. Right, so here, we've been here before. 